Here comes the last gamble, last gambage. Discard two, roll a dice, five. Draw five cards. Let's do this. Hey, true Nate. This is it for Tai Chi! Hey, Trinade putting all set cards on the field back to the hand. Drew five. This is his final turn! Gio, come here. Wave your arms around. Oh my god, it's a Snipe Hunter! Snipe Hunter, you could discard a card from your hand to destroy a card in the field! 66% chance you roll a dice. Anything that's not a one or a six, you destroy a card on the field. Destroyed! I need you to dab on each destroy. Dab on it! Not yet, not yet. Uh -oh. Dab on the dice. Dab on it! Destroyed! Banishing two for industrial strength, the boss monster of the deck. You can banish a thunder to destroy a monster in a back row card on the field. Sets his own back row for destruction. If this is a wild tornado, goes for the Amazon Swordsman and his back row. It is a treacherous... Oh my Jesus, he's got two cards left in the hand! You need a dab on both of these! You have to! You have to! Dab! No! <laughs> Do it again! Oh my god, it's another industrial strength! Oh my Jesus! He did not even need it! Wait, did he not need it? Is this the math? The math? The math? Oh my god, he's off by 300 life! No! Oh my god, really? Really? Can C.D. McNairich make a comeback at 100 life? Oh, damn. Damn it. Damn it! No! YouTube, hello YouTube. This is the grand finals of the Clan Wars. Clan Wars. This is how it all happened. It was like this. We had all of these clans, and they all got eliminated. We are in the final. It is Waru Fuzaki versus the usual suspects. It, there's still a chance for you to join Clan Wars yourself. This is just a Clan Wars welcome tournament. It's just welcome to Clan Wars. It's $500 sponsored by myself. This are this is the Clan War details. Full details in Clan Wars info, you create a clan of 5 to 15 players, you 5 vs 5 battle against opposing clans, first and second place win all of the entry money, the rest of the money is from me, $850. We had the open clan tournament, which you're watching right now, the grand finals, but don't worry, you could still join the two month season and the playoffs plus championship, you have till August 20th to create or join a clan. No friends, no problem. In the Discord, Gia and myself have been combining clanmates together. People that don't even know each other. They're coming together. We had a clan today play. They did very well. I'm very happy for them. All 10 players could play weekly. Equal play enforced. All 10 members pay a $10 entry. You all get equal prize support. Every Monday, you may recruit new members. So if you don't like your clan members, you could recruit new ones every Monday. You get a full refund if you're kicked from the clan. $350 for top performing players. All right, but if you have friends, let's say you have friends, all you need is at least four other friends. If you have four other friends, you could create a clan of five people up to 15. You go to register clan or you PMG it to create a clan. You could also use the looking for clan or hashtag clan recruitment to see other clans recruiting. Gia is actively pairing players like we were shown before. You get private channels plus a war room. The war room is for you adding slash joining other opposing clans to schedule matches. You get brackets in the Discord to represent your clan. Every Monday, you could recruit new members. You get $350 from me. Even if your clan performs poorly, you could win money as an individual player. That all leads into what we're doing today. This is today. Already happened. Happening right now while you're watching. The meat of Clan Wars is the two-month season. August 20th through August 15th. It's eight weeks. Your clan versus two clans a week, 16 total matches. That means if you have a clan of 10 people, all 10 members get to play every week. All 10. You don't have to schedule a, a big thing or four hours and maybe you don't even know if you play or not. You don't have to worry about that. It's any time, any day during the week. 
Best clans make it to the playoffs, compete for thousands. We have $3,000 we're playing for. Best performing players are paid $350. Here's an example. I clapped Gia on Tuesday. Jason claps Jim on Friday. You guys figure it out. You play whenever you want on your own time against two other clans a week. Then, the best performing clans of the two-month season make it to the playoffs plus championship where you win thousands of dollars. Top four plus finals are live streams. All donations during the stream will go towards the top two clans. Best of three matches. That means best of three, then best of three, then best of three. That's potentially nine duels. Okay, it's exciting. Let's do it. Grand finale. This is Fur Hire versus Vampires. Oh boy. Taichi at the top. Look at that thick, thick deck. That's a thick 30 card deck. 30 card Amazons. Unfortunately, not going first though. First goes to Black Samurai. Opens up beat. That is quite ideal for a fur hire player. Beat will summon a fur hire from the hand, then search the deck for any fur hire monster. Beat into Wiz. Wiz will give him 500 life, and also once per turn can negate a spell or trap by discarding a fur hire. Not good for Tai Chi. If Tai Chi opened up a grass that's greener, Wiz will now potentially negate it. No back row for Black Samurai. That is one good thing for Tai Chi. Does not have to worry about an Econ nor a Treacherous. That grass that looks greener. That's it. Wiz negates grass that looks greener. Does he have another? Grass number two. <laughs> oh my God, Tai Chi's gonna OTK. He milled. A Samurai Skull, a Vampire Grimson, a Retainer, a Familiar, a Skull, and a Kanadia. He did mill two Field Spells, two Kanadias, and a Takeover. Now, someone in the chat said it was a bad mill, but milling a Familiar or a Retainer opens up so many plays. He is not Normal Summon yet, so let's do it. Vampire Familiar, you're going to send a Vampire from your hand to the grave to Special Summon onto the field, pay 500 life, Search your deck for any vampire monster from your deck. Vampire Familiar searching out Vampire Scarlet Scourge. Vampire Scarlet Scourge, if this card is normal or special summon, you could pay 1,000 life, then target one vampire in your graveyard, except Vampire Scarlet Scourge. You special summon it, but it cannot attack this turn. Now, Scarlet Scourge, any monster destroyed by battle, you could special summon onto your side of the field at the end of the battle phase. He's targeting the vampire. He goes for Vampire Grimson. If a monster you control will be destroyed by battle or by an opponent's card effect, you can pay 1,000 life for each monster that would be destroyed instead. Vampire Domain. Any battle damage you deal to your opponent, you gain that life. Vampire Scourge. Special summon beat to your field. Now he did use beatdown, giving his monsters plus 600 for the turn. They can come back whenever they want. He needs, you know, it's, it's not easy. It's not an easy comeback. All right, Seal is going to activate the special summon a fur hire from the hand. Then he'll be able to add Dinah from the graveyard back to the hand. Donpa. Donpa in attack position. Very interesting. All right. Looks like he potentially has an econ play. Maybe. Maybe. What is going on here? There you go. That is his econ take play. He's gonna tribute off the Dumpa, right? Right? Tribute off the Dumpa. Takes the Vampire Scourge. This will be a plus 600 attack boost beatdown. Puts the Wiz in attack position. Beatdown, plus 600 until the end phase. Seal swinging in on the beat. Grimson pays 1,000 life to protect. <laughs> oh my god, 
god, Grimson, you can pay 1,000 life to protect any of your monsters. Oh my Jesus! Grimson! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Grimson! Putting him down to 100 life points! <laughs> Did he take the wrong guy? I think so. Beat down! You have a whiz in attack, sir! That's it. Taichi takes game two with the grass vampires. He's going to gain life dealt with the vampires domain. Oh my Jesus, plus 1200. Finished. Vampires to fur hire say, you fools, you goddamn furry scum. Wow! Alright, Taichi's going first. That is ideal for batteries. Duel. Turn one. Turn one, Thunder Seahorse. He's going to add two Battery Man Solars from the deck to the hand. You can't special summon that turn. Likely setting a Microcell. Microcell on flip will special summon a battery from the deck. And you get to draw a card. No back row though. Right, right. Weak. Weak. Turn one beat. That is usually ideal for a fur hire player. He's going to summon a fur hire from his hand, then search his deck for any fur hire monster he wants. Rob, how come nobody sits any submits anything through the Hall of Fame anymore on the Duelings Meta webpage? I have no idea what you're talking about. Donpa. Donpa in attack position. Beat into Donpa. Beat is going to search for any fur hire monster he wants. No recon into OTK here. Ooh, there's his recon. There's his recon. Dampa going to summon. Into recon. Very nice, very nice. Donpa gonna destroy himself, making room for the recon effect. Recon is gonna special summon a fur hire from the hand. The recon will destroy that face down monster. What a pro play from the usual suspects, Black Samurai. Perfectly setting up a Donpa pop into recon. Pop that face down card. Wiz going to gain 1,000 life. This is lethal if he does not have a sphere Karibo. Beat down. Is it Sphere Kribo? Sphere Kribo? Sphere Kribo? Oh my god, it's so clean. There's no delay. No! Wiz on the final attack finishes him! The usual suspects Black Samurai defeats Taichi! Duel. I'm joking. Just don't say anything. Jam versus Dat WZ. WZ. Dat versus the usual suspects jam. She said it. She said it. Princess on attack, summoning an Amazon from the deck. Easy peasy. Treacherous trap hole, destroying two on the field. Hey, true nade! This is a big play. Beat into. Dampa. No, that's a recon. Beat in a. He wanted it to be a Dampa. It is a recon, though. Recon into Wiz. Beat down into. Is he going to negate the Amazon's onslaught? Yes, he will. He negates the effect to banish. All using Fighter, yeah. Interesting. Yeah, the Japanese uh, players are all using Amazon's Fighter. Good stuff. Hey, true nade number two. Wiz, no negate on the Kanadia. Because, I mean, he'll flip back up this turn, but it does allow him to summon a Kanadia from the grave. He could have stopped that if he wanted to. Seal add to the hand. Banish, banish, banish. It was lethal if he negated. If he had another monster in his hand. Onslaught effect negated in the battle phase. 
Jam summons a seal from the hand, adds a Dompa from the deck to the hand. Beatdown, plus 300 attack. Wall of Disruption, Wiz to negate. Second Wall of D, double D, minus 2400 attack off of every single monster. That is game. <laughs> Holy, yeah, it's right. Oh my Jesus. Double wall of D through the, oh my God. How? How did you win that? Waru Fuzaki clan. God damn. That's it. Waru Fuzaki clan is your official clan open champions. I knew that they would win. Oh my Jesus. Here are the top decks. So first of all, we have Yoshi Fuma. Sorry for the blurry deck list, Very guys. Japanese. Yoshi Fuma with batteries. Um, I don't really know what skill this is. What skill is that? Uh, it might be Last Gamble. We'll I never don't, know. I don't know, but it will be on the website. So if you want to check this out on the website, it will be on the website. We'll fix you. But don't worry. God damn, triple floodgate, triple Needle ceiling. Oh my god, two snipe hunter with the hate grenade. The J Japan players know how to bring the spice. Simon. Simon's like some kind of national. Shut. Yep. They're not using furries. No fur hire. The winning clan not using fur hire. And I'm told that, oh my god, ban fur hire. Fur hire is so strong. Oh my Jesus. I don't know anything. Jesus. Oh my Jesus! Oh my Jesus! So wow, instead of playing triple wall D, he's playing triple floodgate. So they all really like got together like, you! You cover the floodgates! I got the wall of D's! You do the vampires! I'll cover the D's. They covered all the spice. Good stuff. Thank you, Simon. Now we got Dat. Dat boy. Dat. Let's see what Dat brought to the table. A hero Dat. What? <laughs> Where are these decks coming from? Is that this is of the this is not real. Ties of the Brethren heroes. What? What is that? <laughs> I don't know. Is that real? I've never seen this before. Is that real life? Does he know that this is not a, a legendary deck requirements, right? Oh my Jesus! He built a legendary. He built a legendary deck. They all built legendary decks. Ties of the Brethren heroes. That is from Dat. God damn, that's crazy. Deck number two from him. All right, Silent Magician. It is quite standard, a Silent Magician. Uh, I noticed that, I don't think Japan's really using Switcheroo with Cosmic Cyclone. That's kind of a, like a Duel Links meta thing. So, very cool. Dat, Chariot with his spicy decks. Part of me we'll see if they're spicy. They gonna call him Chariot. Chariot. I was really excited. All right. Um. Hey, what the hell is that? Downbeat. What the? Let me read that card. I have to read that card. I'm sorry. Downbeat. He's playing Downbeat. Tribute a face-up monster. Special summon from your deck one monster with the same original type and attribute of the tributed monster on the field, but one level lower. You can only activate one Downbeat per turn. So. I guess he uses this to summon Princess from his deck onto the field. Nice. Chariot. So very good. You could tribute an Amazon Swordsman. Special summon a Princess from your deck. It's like he's playing four Princess. All right. Sp None of them are playing Fur Hire. You understand that? You understand that? Do you understand that? Do you understand? Do you understand? Five players Waru Fuzaki clan won $500 zero for higher zero the final deck list from Taichi himself unfortunately like we were watching and it just it wasn't doing so well on stream but everyone else is playing batteries in his clan I think two others are playing batteries he uh, so okay they were all playing last gamble because I remember they, that, that's what it looks like so very good Karibo snipe hunter Last gamble batteries. God damn. God damn. <laughs> Vampires! Oh my Jesus! Beat down vampires. Oh my Jesus. We saw this on stream clapping left and right. 
So yeah, I saw him mill two field spells and now I know that, yeah, I was wondering like, he's, why is he not going to the field spell play? He only plays two, he plays three takeovers. He loves takeover, two simultaneous loss, simultaneous loss in the bottom right. Basically, both of you and your opponent mill the top card of their deck and it triggers the field spell effect. Three grass that's greener. We saw him use grass that's greener. Got negated by Wiz. Played a second one. One desire. Two Kanadia. One domain. Domain allows you to summon in addition to your normal summon or set. And you also life steal off your opponent's life points when you deal damage. Grimson. We saw Grimson win duels. Where'd that Grimson at? Where'd that Grimson at? Look at this Grimson. Tai Chi said, My vampire was undefeated in the tournament. There you go, undefeated vampires, $500 from us, not Thank from the entry God. fee, not from anything else. We give it to you, Taichi and the Waru Fuzaki clan. Thank you for the clan open tournament. I love you all. Thank you. I'm excited for the rest of Clan Wars. You all could still join yourself if you want to. We are up to 3,000, well, 500 gets shaved off because of this tournament, but we're up to, I think, $2,500. For the Clan Wars, check it out, exclamation mark Clan Wars. Love you all. Thank you.